The first mindset shift is that I decided I am no longer looking for someone to make me happy. And because it was the most violent trauma triggering episode, my nervous system almost got burned and could not take it anymore. And that's when it clicked for me. I suddenly surrendered to the reality that nobody was going to give me the love that would substitute my lost connection with my father and his unconditional love. No external source of love is reliable and I was just going to remain in that state of my cup being empty. This was a pivotal moment in my life and the best thing that ever happened to me. For people who want to have the spiritual angle of this, this is called an ego death, whereby your higher self or subconscious mind will put you and bring you life circumstances, each stronger and more brutal than the previous one, in an attempt to recreate your traumas and to get you to surrender and to break your ego and all these artificial things that you've built around yourself to protect your identity. And so what started happening naturally to me is that I started feeling self-love inside of me because I was no longer trying to fulfill the void inside of me. By simply accepting that no love was going to come from no one, I felt my own self-love. It wasn't forced. I did not do any positive affirmations or anything of that sort. I just hit rock bottom and I sat with the feelings of defeat and surrender that came with that. Join me on Patreon to get access to full videos and be part of an amazing community of like-minded women.